What a march, man. I mean, we haven't spoken. That was insane. Insane. I mean, from, from Brady coming out of retirement all the way to Bobby Wagner winding up with the Rams. I mean, that was, that two-and-a-half-week stretch was off the charts. I'm going to ask you a sports talk radio question. I'll give you four uh, transactions, two wide receivers on the move, two quarterbacks on the move, and you tell me which one is going to make the biggest difference come the fall, best you can tell right here. Devontae Adams going to the Raiders, Tyreek Hill, to the Dolphins, Russell Wilson to the Broncos, and then Matt Ryan to Indianapolis. Which one of those do you think will have the biggest impact this fall, Kurt Warner? What do you think? First, let me say I I, I like all the moves. Oh, but but it's, you know, so I think why, yes. you know all of those guys are going to help their teams in different ways. Um, but when you know I break it all down, yes, uh, you know I say to myself, Tyreek Hill, unbelievable. Still a lot of questions on if Tua can use him correctly. And that, to me, is going to be something that's going to be fascinating because they put the pieces together. So I'm going to X out Tyreek Hill. Okay. Matt Ryan, I think, helps that team and makes them better with his leadership. But, again, I don't think he's necessarily the difference maker to get them over the top with where he's at in his career. So it falls to those other two moves right there. I'm going to lean towards Devontae Adams. Um, he's a special player. He's a guy that gives Derek Carr uh, a, a unique beast, you know, on the other side of, of guys like Darren Waller. And, you know, I, I'm a big fan of Derek Carr. I, I think he, when he plays aggressively and attacks and has guys to do that, he, he's a different kind of quarterback. And so I'm excited to see that move. As much as I like Russell Wilson in Denver, I'm still not 100% sold on all the young pieces around him that I know everybody says, oh, they're ready to win a championship. I'm not fully sold that all those guys just become great players because Russell Wilson's there, even though Russell makes them better. Plus, you know, understanding what is in that division. I'm going to go with Devontae Adams being, uh, you know, the biggest of those four moves and will have the biggest impact uh, in that division um, you know, this fall. I, just the other day, Kurt, um, I came up with my top five teams in the AFC, which got so much more, diff, um, you know, competitive, so much deeper of a pool of the conference, right? And so um, I, I and in, in putting those five together, I had three AFC West teams in there, and I had the, the, the team that was the best ranked, I had the Raiders at the top, yep. and because uh, I I like the addition of Chandler Jones, yep. you know uh, Waller, Carr, and and again you can't discount the fact that Carr and Devontae Adams have thrown to each other before, and they you know they were roommates. So it, 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 Carr and getting his contract yesterday said throwing to uh, Adams is like riding a bike. You know what I'm <laughs> saying? Like this is not going to be that much of a of a of a transition. When, yeah, when I mean, they get makes, there, he makes the game easier for a quarterback because he wins so quickly and creates separation. So, you know, Derek has been good. He gives the ability to make Derek even better. Josh Jacobs, if he gets healthy again, and in right. fact, I mean, I, I just, I do. I, I like the pieces. This is a team that battled down the stretch with all the things they went through last year. Battled down the stretch, got into the playoffs, had a chance to even beat Cincy on the, you know, on the road. So. I just think that one addition and, and all the focus that has to go to a Devontae Adams makes this team dramatically better. And like you said, I love Chandler Jones uh, being here in Arizona, get to know him and just the leader he is. I think he's huge on the other side of Max. So I, I'm, I am. I, I'm excited about where they're at. And I think they're, you know, the team in the division that got, you know, better than anybody else. And, uh, you know, you wonder about the Chiefs without Tyree Kill. You know, where are they? You know, do they fall closer to the pack without the difference maker there? So I, I do look for the Raiders to uh, to make a move and, and, you know, be in the playoffs again, and, and we'll see how far they can go. Hey, you watched all the way to the end. Thanks for that. Watch more right here.